curtains. Close the curtains. Hey, man. Close the curtains. Close. My soul's hurting even if my heart working. See, now, if I'm smiling and smirking, can't you see I my bought soul's three bottles of wine for the four of us later. Since we'll be eating beef, I bought all red wines. I bought some chocolate cookies, raspberries, salad, garlic, and onions. Super duper excited. I still have a lot of cleaning to do around the house and cooking to do. So yeah, gotta hurry up. So you gotta put salad in this tiny ass plate. Hello. <laughs> Hi. I saw this in your vlog. Oh, it's so cool <laughs> to see. Oh my gosh. Oh, welcome. Hello. <laughs> wow, your place is like so so nice. I mean, I always saw like glimpses of it in your um, vlog. <laughs> it looks nicer in person. Chef Ashley, finally seeing you at home. I only see this through your vlogs. Do you feel being here? It feels unreal. Got the Korean beef ready for you guys. Oh my god, mm -hmm. Dude, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Okay, I mean, I tried to, I tried to post it, but haven't had enough time, you know? <laughs> oh. Oh, God. This is what it's like to <laughs> be married, huh? <laughs> Hubby! Oh my God, I love it. Whoa. Look at how red this is. <laughs> Ashley bought us raspberries for dessert. I would never buy them for myself because they're expensive, but for my guests, I'll splurge. <laughs> you can eat it all. Thank you. <laughs> I'll just use it. <laughs> hey! Don't oh, the dirty sink! Oh, hey! <laughs> Thank you. We're preparing desserts now. Let's go. Wow, Girl Scout cookies and everything. Yeah. The moors are the best. Who's Who's my my favorite? Favorite? Wait, no. They have a different name. Caramel Delights? Caramel Delights. <gasps> Wait, I don't think I've tried these. Oh, girl. Are they good? So good. So, so we're a bit drunk, as you guys can tell. <laughs> so we got yeah, some low calorie um, ice cream. Mm -hmm. Doing my makeup right now and getting ready. So yesterday's mini house serving party was so much fun. I finally decided to just invite some of my friends over. I just felt like my house wasn't ready and I needed to make it complete before I have anyone over. But I realized that it's always going to be a work in progress and it's never going to be complete or perfect or the way I want it. So I was like, ugh, whatever. Let's just invite my friends over and have a good time. It's not even like they care, you know? They don't care about how the house looks and stuff. It's just me. And I could only invite three people at a time because I only have four chairs in the house. Well, I only have three chairs and then I had to sit on my this stool right here. So yeah, I don't know if I can ever invite more than three people. It's just a really tiny space, you know? Today I actually feel like doing my makeup for once. 
I'm using Fenty Beauties number 5 peach eyeshadow palette. So Subin bought a bottle of wine, so we ended up drinking four bottles. When I moved out on my own, I told myself that I would invite my friends over a lot. Joan would always have wine nights at her place and I was so grateful and appreciative that she would, you know, provide hospitality. And I always wanted to kind of do the same too. And yesterday, even though I didn't prepare anything like fancy or really over the top, my heart felt so full seeing my friends happy and being able to provide for them. Yeah, just having my loved ones over endless conversations really really made me happy and before my friends came I was so jittery and I was so like nervous and anxious but excited at the same time and I had a lot of fun preparing for them also I realized that this is the 13th episode of the adulting series which means that I've been living alone for about 10 weeks now that is mind-boggling because Time just passed by so quickly but at the same time I kind of feel like I've been living here for a really long time I mean I think I adapt to the environment pretty quickly so maybe that's why which also makes me think like what do I film next for lips I'm going to use Lily by Red's Ginger Roco hmm it's a little darker than I would have liked I am not using ginger roco. Hold on. I'm gonna use Espoir's butter rum. The lips look a, a lot darker in the camera for some reason. But it looks like this. Oh, the lighting is so important. You need to get better lighting. This is my completed look for today. Wow, I actually tried today, you know. I put on three different eyeshadow colors. I put on mascara. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go change and get ready for a radio. I got my first ever Jordans. I only own one pair of Jordans and I don't even know what model number it is i got it as a gift for my friends when i was leaving new york nine years ago wow did i just say nine years yeah it's been nine years since i left new york for korea when i saw these jordan ones they're called jordan one low unc university blue i just have to get these because they were the prettiest sky blue color look at that so pretty oh my god i bought it off this app called cream it was quite expensive compared to the other sneakers that i've bought before but i think it's totally worth it i love it so much ah. so just taking selfies right now matching shirt too. Just go for that all blue look. Ew, it's kind of wrinkled. I've just been obsessed with baby blue recently. I feel bad for the color yellow because I was obsessed with that for a while but now I'm just like meh about it. I don't want to take it. How should I take it?
afternoon. Just made myself a tomato, apple, honey juice for brunch. So before I put the tomatoes into the blender, I boiled it for like 40 seconds because tomatoes are just healthier um, eating them cooked rather than raw. So yeah, heard about that somewhere before. So I was like, okay, let me try that. And then I peeled the skin off and then put it in with some honey and added some apple just for that extra flavor. And it's really good. I have Pilates later at 2. I've been taking trial classes. So yesterday was my first class and today will be the last trial class. And then uh, I'll have to decide if I want to continue or not. I don't want to eat something too heavy before the class. So I'm just eat, drinking juice and I'll probably eat lunch right after the class. I feel like I go there to eat. Anyways, just gonna finish this juice. Gonna work on editing for a little bit and then Get ready for Pilates. Just listening to my LP, my two new LPs that I got from one of our listeners on Sound K. This is from Singapore and the sweetest got me the Kings of Convenience Declaration of Dependence album. It also got me a 1975 album. This comes with two LPs actually. <gasps> it's transparent. It's like glass. Dude, the design for this LP and the album. <gasps> so nice. I love it. But thank you so much. And I just thought it was the sweetest thing because he included a letter, the Kings of Convenience album. He said it's calming to listen to after a long day at work, perfect background music while having housewarming party or just going about your daily tasks. Sheer simplicity. And for the 1975 album, he said it has a palette of electronic sounds, sentimental lyrics, dreamy instrumentals. I'm so grateful. Music and my record player are things that make me really happy and I try to incorporate them into my daily life because you know even if they're just like small acts it definitely gives me so much joy just waking up and putting on music on the record player and even coming home and having music on while I'm getting ready for bed and it reminds me that you don't need really like expensive things to make you happy. I'm gonna continue to listen to some songs and get ready to sleep.